paddy. <laughs> Very simple. How do you, what, what's the first thing? When you go into a field now, are you thinking which way is the harvest you want to go around this, or do you just have to drop this and forget about it after that? Like, uh, Yeah, I, I I consider what way the harvest is going. That's only because I used to drive a harvest. Now. Okay. Well, a lot of lads know just go in and off the field, but uh, you sure head once you get the back sport off. Two headlands, three headlands, mainly three headlands is just easier. Trailers are big enough to turn on headlands and stuff. Yeah. After that then just get level as quick as you can. What do you have to be watching for now when you're driving triples? Like it's not everyone can just go up, up here and off you go there now for the day with a set of triples, you know? It's hard enough here, like you have know, a front mower, it's out with the front of the engine and then you have the two back mowers are close to you at the back window. Okay. So you really have to pay attention, like you would, wouldn't have them ready on much now. Yeah. That's the biggest thing, stones really and Oh, just kind of use your head around water trucks and around a gap like. You have the Command Pro configured for the front and the back. How How is it set up like? How have you personalised the Command Pro to suit, what you, suit them all, like suit the job? The front mowers worked on front lifts, so I, I only assigned the function to A. It's just easy enough on the front. Okay. And then you have C and D on the back. And I have C is the left switch, that's working on the left more. D is the right switch, that's working on the right more. So it's kind of easy enough to figure out. You have left and right on the back of the lever as well, so. Okay. And then you have 12, 12 of the auto steer, or auto track, whatever you want to call it. And um, on the back then I have my engine cruises. Two is max cruise, and one is just kind of gentle cruise if I was getting down the biggest stone around. So you're auto steer, but you're able to skip the different runs, it's kind of handy for getting the job done, I suppose. If you're on a tight field, it's nice to have skip runs, you don't have such a tight turn and circle. Yeah. You can skip on one or two. Sometimes do straight lines, other times they do curve lines okay. to eliminate all the shock round to one side. Oh yeah. If I pick a straight line, I'll end up with shock round on both sides of the field. And oh, it's just slowing down, like it's just the harvest was turning, you're turning. It's, if you went with a curve and a ditch, at least all the shock rounds to one side. I don't know, in the last two months I'd say maybe two Sundays off. Oh, just, Corn, it's just it's with the, with the bad That's spring, right. the way Ever, things rolled out. Everything came in together. Yeah, yeah, didn't real it? disaster. Yeah, like we we took off, we finished sowing. We were actually sowing maize last week. The boy and the harvester, he had he had to sow 20 acres of maize in the morning, come back, think up the harvester, and do a long day in the harvester. And with Edward since 2017, 2017 was the first year I came from. I done a bit of mowing the first year and the harvester. And then I give two seasons on the harvester. I give a season on the loader, and I'm kind of floating around now. I do a lot of the mowing, but you could meet me on a bell, or you could meet me on, on anything.